Hey guys, it's the Solo Coffee, and today in this Monster Legends Leaks video, I have a bunch of new leaked events, as well as some new leaked Mythic movesets, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so the first leaked events are the Summer Event, the Summer Challenge, and the Summer Coins and Monster Wood. So basically, there will be a 72-hour challenge for Summer that you will be able to get on Donna, Anton, of Cosmic, and Marley from. And the coins to do that event will be in Monster Wood, and they'll be in Summer Challenges, including, it looks like, Daily Missions, Marathons, Mazes, and Seasonal Chests. So yeah, definitely do this event, it seems pretty cool. And then we have Chooser Path Ignis slash Bombetta for all and Letalis Ulrika for owners. So Ignis and Bombetta are pretty decent monsters. Bombetta is very good. So definitely try to get him. And if you have Letalis or Ulrika, you can try to rank them up. And then the upcoming Air Sockers are for the free Legends Pass monster and the paid one. As usual, they always do that. So it's not too surprising. And then there will be some Golden Legends Pass chests. So if you have the Golden Legends Pass, you can get these chests for real money. And honestly, I don't think they're really worth it. But if you have money to spend on the game, go for it. And then we have the House of Thunders Marathon, which will be coming this Friday, actually. So definitely try to get this monster. And now we actually have his trait. Let's go and look at that. At rank 3, Celestial. At rank 1, he becomes cooldowns activation immunity. And at rank 3, he'll apply minor blind at the start of the battle, which is pretty decent, I guess. And then we have a new monsters move set, Raijin. So his first decent move is probably Thundering Tycho. Applies triple damage to one ally during two turns, restores all cooldowns, and gives 100% of stamina to one ally. That's a pretty good move. And then Ushi no Tokimari is deals heavy thunder damage to all enemies, applies curse and shock to all enemies, which is a pretty good move. And then Warrior and Protector applies Anticipation Hater to itself, deals heavy thunder damage to one enemy, applies a legendary phobic shield to itself, requires cooldown. That is a pretty good move. I don't think I've ever seen Anticipation Hater in a move before, so yeah, I'm sure that'll be very powerful against anticipation monsters and then thousand curses of izanami i don't know if i said that right deals insane thunder damage to all enemies applies curse shock and daze to all enemies which is a very good special and he's a thunder fast attacker with anticipationator and strong buffing skills as we already saw and then we have another new monsters move set monster eye they just added an a to the end of monster to think of that name very creative so the first decent move is probably purple corruption deals moderate dark damage to one enemy applies corrupted and poison one enemy which is pretty decent and then spawn of the leviathan deals moderate dark damage to all enemies gains as much life as damage dealt applies poison all enemies gives 40 percent stamina to itself regardless well and that's a pretty decent move i guess and then queen of monster deals moderate nature damage to all enemies removes 100 stamina from all enemies decreases all enemies maximum life that's a pretty decent move and then the great poison deals moderate dark damage to all enemies plus corrupted and poison all enemies i haven't seen very many monsters using corrupted recently so seeing as this monster has a single target and aoe move that'll probably make them pretty good and if you didn't know corrupted is basically just possession but it's different but it still does the same thing so it's not really different it's just called a different thing and then the special monster of prime deals insane nature damage to all enemies plus poison antivirus and mega corrupted all enemies which is pretty good special and monster is a nature controller with stamina draining poison life skill and corruption skills which is pretty cool so yeah those are gonna be all the leaks for this video don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye